बचना ऐ हसीनो लो मैं आ गया ए बचना ऐ हसीनो लो मैं आ गया हुस्न का शिक हुस्न का दुश्मन अपनी अदा है यारों से जुदा ए बचना the umpires out in the middle. We're awaiting now the arrival of the Australian players to be let out by Bobby Simpson. The not outs are Gavaska and Chauhan. So we'll take you back now with action about to start here in Sydney in about two minutes time to our central commentary point to Jim Burke and Keith Miller. And there we have the Indian batsmen uh, coming out. Uh, Chauhan on 35 and Gavaska on 45. India no wicket for 86. Only some 45 runs behind the uh, Australian total. To open the bowling, it looks like it'll be Clark who'll be bowling from the northern end. Quite an attacking field, three slips in a gully as Clark bowls the first ball of the day. And more or less an arm loosener with uh, no real pace coming from that particular delivery off the wicket. Clark to Kavaska. And runs to Kavaska, probably two in this. That's been coming back for two as Gannon does the fielding from fine leg. So Gavaska now 47 and the total no wicket for 88. Australia certainly needs a breakthrough. Thompson to Chauhan. And runs immediately to Chauhan. He moves on to 36 with that single. Thompson bowling to Gavaska. And that ball lifting uh, quite deceptively and landing short of the uh, slip fieldsman. That was uh, Hughes fielding at second slip. But a good delivery from Thompson. It really flies. Uh, this will give Thompson quite a bit of encouragement. It gets up quickly. It really skidded through. Down, down, just landed just in front of Hughes and slipped. It and another good delivery from Thompson. Keeping a little low, in fact, uh, well, that was pitched further up uh, than the previous delivery. Save for pitch this one, and Gavaska moves away quite a way to the offside and comes in behind his pad there. You see, Tommy, uh, looking at the replay, it uh, seems to be cutting the ball quite a bit from the off. And that's four runs. That's a beautiful shot from Chauhan. Clark just wandering a bit in accuracy. And he slashed that one through the slips cordon. And it's Thompson to bowl a new over. He'll be bowling to Gavaska. That's a good shot from Gavaska. Timed that beautifully. He should get two. Fielded by Dyson down there at fine leg. So Gavaska, 49, and a great return from Dyson. Thompson to Gavaska. Well, that was a nasty one. There's an appeal for court behind, and he's out. Gavaska is out. Court Rickson, Bolt Thompson for 49. India losing their first wicket, one for 97. I think it, I think this comes off his glove. But uh, he, uh, you can see him push the bat behind his body, and I, I would say it just came off came off his glove. Let's watch this. Well, um, <clears throat> I don't know if that's his glove or not, but um, hmm, but, uh, oh, you saw it, Jim Burke, and I saw it, Jim Burke, but um, I think the umpire may like to have a look at that one himself later on. Yes, that was an unusual one, but uh, a very good innings uh, by Gavaska for 49. Probably a little unlucky to be out uh, for that total. So India losing their first wicket. The new batsman is uh, Armanath. And it's Clark who's uh, to bowl the new over to Chauhan. And he could be out caught, dropped in the gully by Sergeant, I think it was. And that went straight to him. An easy chance, so Sergeant not having a good match. 
Yes, he clipped it hard, but it went straight to the man in the gully, and they're the ones you catch, as you can see, straight up in the air and um, in the right spot. In his hand, as you see, and there, too, you're running around to retrieve the ball. Oh. And that's a, an unusual type of shot. Where is it? It's uh, landed short of the fence. It's not going to go into the fence, and Chowhan, in fact, wasn't running. He thought it was four, but it looks like it's only going to be one. Only one run. Chowhan hitting that shot, thinking it was a certain four. It hit into the turf and uh, stopped with plenty of backspin. I think he used a nine iron, Jim. <laughs> I think he uh, got a bit of a look like a Jack Nicklaus shot. Uh. <laughs> he certainly stopped. Uh, this outfield, of course, uh, uh, is fairly wet as a result of the uh, morning rain. And now... Uh, Umpire Brooks just came up to Umpire yeah, Baylash. One, one short. Oh, one two. short. Well, they're both calling... I don't know what's going on. This is a uh, game's getting out of hand. Both signalling one short. I don't know whether they're talking about one short at each end or what is going on. Still so, undecided. Well, Annie actually ran one runner from... Uh, well, I was watching what I the ball. Okay. I was watching the ball and I... Uh, I don't know whether they ran one or three. I was watching the ball come into the outfield. I think, in fact, and probably it's no run. They ran one and... Oh, no, it's got to be... They've got to run one short, so they've got to run two, haven't they, really? Yeah. A bit confused there, uh, viewers. Sorry about that, but Armanath is uh, off the mark with that uh, shot through mid wicket. So we'll call the board as it is. Uh, Armanath one, Chauhan 42, and the total 99. One for 99, I would think, although that last single might have brought up the 100. Well, the board reads one for 100 with Chohan on 42 and Armanath one. Sorry about that little bit of confusion. Our scorer had his eyes on men running and he informs us they ran three and one short. So that clears that up. Oh, that was a fast delivery. And I think he would have got an edge that one because the... Uh, there was no appeal from any of the fieldsmen or the bowler. Yes, that, he must have. There was not, nobody went up for the appeal, and uh, he wasn't very far away for uh, being out, really. So I would say that he definitely got a, a nick. Thompson bowling to Armanath. Ooh, didn't that one take off? Rickson taking it over his head. Not only that, it went the other way. That's a sort of a it cut away towards the slips after it landed. You watch this cut away to the slips and really rear off the pitch. It goes, look at it, right up and up and up and goes, look high and... And Rickson being a very good Australian rules footballer, that uh, helps him, uh, stands him in good stead once the ball gets above the head. Thompson bowling to Armanath. Not a good shot from Armanath. That's what uh, you were talking about, Keith, although it wasn't a bouncer, but it uh, wasn't a good shot either, was it? Try to pull it or hook it, whatever you like to say, and... Um, he didn't get up as much as the other ones, and maybe just as well, because he might have taken his head with it. You watch this ball, it doesn't get up anywhere near as high as the other one. But you can see hooking up in the air, and if it hits it, he's got to hit the ball up in the air. And uh, this is a shot that's very promising man I would advise to start seriously thinking about and cutting the shot out. Extremely well bowled by Thompson, who's really putting everything into his uh, deliveries at the moment. Equally well played by Armanar. That was a nasty delivery. This one does get up, and um, as Jim Berg says, he plays it well. He's tall, and he's lucky he's tall for this one. He's got the height to get over the ball, which he does. Well bowled Thompson, and well played Armanar. Oh, 
Well, there's a bit of a difference in size there with uh, Kazia and Shanahan. It'll be six foot three versus uh, five feet seven or six. A big boy, isn't he, Kazia? And very powerful with the bat, with that very short back lift. Very powerful when he strikes the ball. Dyson doing the fielding at uh, mid-off. Clark, who's been unlucky uh, today. Had Chauhan dropped by Sergeant in the gully. Well, very well. Uh -oh. It could be out caught. Yes, he's out caught. Caught by man. Chauhan caught man. Bolt Clark for 43. India 2 for 103. Yes, he gets a thick edge and is a very well caught by man in uh, the third slip there. You can see that. Good diving catch here. And it's well caught by man. And well bowled by man, uh, well bowled by Clark. Jim Burke is just saying he's a little unlucky and uh, so this pitch is playing quite a bit differently uh, after that rain this morning and um, a bit more life in it. And as I pointed out, most likely it's because of the little dampness on the ball that accelerates it. And Chauhan, frankly, was never quite at ease. He um, did not look the same confident player that he did yesterday. It was Clark to bowl to Biswanath. And Biswanath immediately off the mark. And he'd be a single. And the total moves on to two for 104. And now Dyson coming out of the gully, uh, the third slip area, to back to uh, mid-off for the other batsman, Amanath. And Mann has moved across from third slip to leg slip. So a very attacking field. And that could be four runs. Although that ball seems to be slowing up, but it should get there all right. Yes, four to uh, Armanath. He just got an edge to it. So it's Thompson bowling to Vismanath. And that's well run by the Indian batsman. Gannon doing the fielding. Backed up by Cozy. They're looking for another run, but Cozy was too quick for them. Thompson to Armanath. Must have gone very close to his off stump. That was a good ball that cut back very fast. And uh, Armanath a little lucky. Yes, he chops it down onto his feet and uh, maybe just as well because it could have gone right onto the stump. What's it go down after it hits the bat? A whisker. Very close. Thompson bowling to Armanath. Runs to Armanath. Possibly only one. Clark coming up from fine leg. He's coming back for two, but uh, Vismanath sends him back. And just as well. Beautiful throw by Clark. Thompson to Vismanath. And that's a beautiful shot. A risky cut from the uh, right-handed Indian batsman. Coming back for two. They'll probably get three. And Tui, who did the uh, fielding then, seemed to hurt his leg as he slipped uh, when he got that ball. And he's limping back a little. India 2 for 113. More runs. Single only, with Clark coming up from fine leg to do the fielding. And that should be T, with uh, Armanath on uh, 8. And the total, 2 for 114. Vismanath, the other not-out batsman, 5. So a T, India 2 for 114. And we had the correction to the score during the tea break, that uh, rather unusual situation earlier on where both umpires indicated a short run. Well, 
The scorers weren't too sure what had happened, so they took one run off Chow Han, but the umpires indicated during tea that it should have been two runs. So a further run has been taken off Chow Han's score, and his correct figure now is court man Bowl Clark for 42, and the tea score is two for 113, which is one less than the score we gave you. So that situation now on the scoreboard is correct. India two for 113 in reply to Australia's 131. So first ball after tea, it's Clark to bowl to Amanath, who's on eight. And a no ball called, it was a good ball. I don't think the batsman heard that call at all. And he was beaten, and one more to the score to make it two for 114, with sundries uh, moving on now to ten. Now here's a, an appeal against the light. Straight away, after one ball after T, the umpire's conferring, and the light question has been raised. Now, this is an important tactical move here. Now, the umpires are moving to the far end. they no doubt look back into the gloom of this large school uh, stand area where we are here at the back of the Bradman stand. And that's uh, sort of behind the sideboard. You can see there the brother were in the extreme end of the Bradman stand, just away to the left as you see it, and it's the junction of the Bradman stand and the Noble stand, but uh, what's it to be? All the Australian players are keen to go on, and it's off the field, is it? No, play on. But just before T, Tui was injured slightly and in sliding, trying to stop a run in the, in the field. And there's the hook shot, there's a man out there, he's underneath it, and he's out! That's caught by Gannon. Amanath caught Gannon, bowl Clark 9, 3 for 116. Sam Gannon being congratulated by his teammates and Amanath falls yet again to that hook shot of his. I think that must be about three times that he's been out to that stroke. And let's see how he plays it on this occasion. Short inside the line hit pretty well in fact hit too well and the only fault in that particular stroke was the fact that Amanath did not get over the top of the ball because there's Gannon and notice how easily he takes that particular catch just above eye level so Thompson to Vishwanath and it's almost a chance that was just wide of the fieldsman. It's coming down to the boundary. That's that was leg bars. Leg bars indicated by umpire Brooks. It um, looked as it may have been a chance off the bat. Rickson couldn't get to it, but there was no worry there because it was off the body of the, of the player rather than the bat or hand. And the score goes up by four runs. Three for 120. And Sundry's moving up to 14. Look at that deflection again. Off the thigh pad. My word, didn't it travel quickly, considering it came off Vishwanath's body. And listen to this crowd. The most enthusiastic crowd now is Thompson, really at top speed. And Saka, just a little bit weak outside the off stump, and has been caught in the slips on two or three occasions. And Rickson's got that as it... No, that was a magnificent effort by Rickson, but uh, no appeal at all by the players, and of course there was a deflection there, we'll watch that again, but that's the end of Thompson's over. The deflection coming off Vinsaka's body. There, the thigh pad. And quite clearly no contact made between bat and ball, but as you can see, Rickson made, I would say, about uh, ooh, three or four metres along the ground virtually to the lake side. Now Thompson has bowled a total of 13 overs for those figures of 1 for 36 and he's bowled 6 overs straight today with the break for T. Now it's Clark again. Clark to Vishwanath. Nice crisp shot, it's going out towards square leg. Gannon's the fieldsman. And a fine throw from Gannon but they're home easily for 2. And Vishwanath on to nine, three for 123. Again to square leg. Let's see if they want to this time. Gannon 
has got the ball. There wasn't a second run there. Again, a good throw from Gannon. So Vishwanath quite wisely stayed at home. So he goes on to 10 and it's 3 for 125. Only six runs the difference in the first inning score. Thompson to Vishwanath. And a chance and dropped. That was dropped. That was a chance. It's going down to the boundary. It won't reach the fence. Now that youngster shouldn't touch that ball because it won't reach the fence. They take three runs. I don't think there was any doubt at all about that. That was a catch. That certainly was. It was going. I think it was certainly travelling. And it was high and to Rickson's right. And moreover, Vishwanath really slashed at that particular delivery. Here it goes. Slash. Top edge. Rickson high. And not a far, far enough to his right. Uh, it seemed to me that Rickson was a little bit slow moving there. So Vishwanath on the 13 with uh, three runs for the stroke. Three for 128. Thompson to Ben Sucker. And a run here. Persia, after the ball, they've taken a single. And that's Ben Sarkis' first run. Three for 129, only two the difference now in the first innings. Now that's a better looking shot. That's at least two. Gannon getting across pretty quickly. And Vishwanath back for an easy two. And he goes on to 15, and the scores are level. Australia made 131, India now 3 for 131, the same total. Since that uh, Rickson miss off Thompson, I think Simpson has moved closer to Rickson. Simpson fielding at first slip. The gap between the keeper and first slip has decreased. Again, runs there. This might be more than one. A long chase back for Kosia. They'll take uh, an easy two. Bishop and Art to 17. Three for 133. India in front on the first innings. And that was, a, that was onto the leg. It was in the air. It would have been a magnificent catch. It would have meant that the ball, one of those ones where it sticks or not, Yes, Kozia isn't in that position to take those sort of catches. Just gauge how quickly the ball went from this. Bang. Kozia, in fact, uh, didn't really get his hands anywhere near the ball. He was still more or less in a semi-upright position when the ball wrapped him on the shins. Kozia there, of course, is stationed for the ball that lifts and the batsman fends off his body. Good shot. That's going a long way down the ground. A long chase for Gannon. Turning for three. And Vishwanath will keep the strike with that three. He goes on now to 20. And Vishwanath, who's playing shots now, gets a, a single away on the on side. He goes on to 21, three for 137. And a chance. Oh. The fieldsman, who was close in man, he, it appeared the ball would go away on the onside. And look at poor Wayne Clark. Look at that whippy action of Wayne Clark's. Up in the air now. And I think man was on his heels. He was rocking back, anticipating probably a back foot drive. Well, there's poetic justice, if it were. The way it goes through the... Mid-off area for a couple of runs, and Vensaka goes on to three. Three for 139.
will Simpson do when he makes a bowling change? Will he, in actual fact, switch Clark to the other end and bring Gannon down in place of Clark, or will he simply put Gannon on at the Randwick end? And a chance is it now, just wide of the off stump, or wide of the bat too. Very close, certainly. A little bit of movement off the wicket. And through the covers. There'll be a couple here that won't reach the boundary. Let's see if they want a third. They've turned for two and they're going for three. And then there's a man we don't often see out there at cover point. But Vishwanath on to 24, three for 142. And down past third slip, a chase for Clark. And they take two. Right. Nice return then to man the ball, of course. I think you caught that on the picture. It was flicked back from um, Clark. Now they're taking a run here. Man has a shot at the stumps. And that was very, very close. And dropped, dropped by Hughes. Both hands to it. Straight to him at second slip. Well, a straightforward chance, this. Thick edge, not even hit hard. Steered in the hands of second slip, and that was too simple a catch to go down. Down it went. And it's no use grabbing after it. The opportunity's been missed. Well, there it goes. That's that shot he loves so much. He's thrashed that through the point area into the fence for four. That's three for 159. And Vishwanath on to 31. Well, man has been brought into the attack, but this time from the northern end after bowling only two overs from the southern end. And he'll be bowling to Ben Sarko. That's a beautiful shot played by Ben Sarko. It's through. Will it reach the fence? Yes. Delightful shot down the wicket, driving it past mid off, and he moves now on to 21, and the total three for 182. Be out caught. No, it's just landed short of the backward point fieldsman. Wasn't a good shot from uh, Vensaka. <laughs> it's a nice shot, but beautifully fielded in the uh, covers. I think it was by Ogilvy. Brilliant bit of fielding. And it's Thompson bowling to Vensaka. He could be out caught. No, oh. Simpson has dropped him, and that was a catch straight to him. So yet another catch put down by the Australians. And Simpson, very, very disappointed. This is the sitter of sitters for a man who feels at first slip. And watch it long way back. Watch it gently, thank you very much. And Simo must be saying, well, what am I doing in slips? Thompson bowling to Viswanath. Nasty one. And the umpires conferring again, Brooks and Baelish, and it's quite possible they might uh, go off, which would be disappointing. No, are they going to play on, or are they? Oh, no, no, Goodness no, me, it's unbelievable. I cannot believe this at all. The not-out batsman, uh, Viswanath, not out 48. Vensaka, not out 23. India, 3 for 190. <laughs> 